Hi, everyone. It is August 5, 2021. You know, I just got this comment. I ran from Colfax, California today. Pray for us. I didn't have to wonder. It, I knew it was a fire, and sure enough, it's a fire near Colfax. Fire is burning in Placer and Nevada County. It is being called the River Fire. It started around 3 this afternoon near Colfax. We can now confirm more than 30 homes have been damaged or destroyed. The fire has burned 1,400 acres, and containment is at 0%. Meanwhile, the Dixie Fire in Plumas County has become a worst-case scenario. The community of Greenville was overrun by flames this evening. You see the video here. Firefighters say they were focusing on trying to get people out of the area who decided to stay. It has been a busy day tracking very dangerous fire conditions. And Sure has, apparently. New California wildfire near Colfax burns dozens of homes in hours. Oh, this exploded. It exploded. Dixie Fire. Uh, pretty much the town of Greenville. Gone. The newsroom within the last hour showing homes and businesses in that town on fire. Greenville sits on Highway 89, southeast of Lake Elmanor. About 800 people live there. Evacuations were ordered there Monday night and again tonight. Communities all around Lake Elmanor are now under that evacuation order. We get more tonight from KTV's Deborah Villalone, live in Marin County. And Deb, you spoke with some of those homeowners who are under orders to leave. Yeah, Heather, two residents both choosing to stay for now. One is watching his escape route so he doesn't get cut off. The other might flee on the water. So here's looking towards Chester, the town of Chester. A lake's eye view as the and, Dixie uh, fire burns. And now we're showing the fire that's going through Greenville currently. As we speak, the town of Greenville is, is on fire. Tommy Pass lives so in Prattville, sandwiched between fire. He and a few others have stuffed their vehicles full of possessions and parked them on the water's edge. He never dreamed when the Dixie fire started three weeks ago it would be burning into Lake Almanor communities. I'm pretty safe living on the lake. I can I just jump on the boat if I need to get out. I'm trying to do everything I could to save the home. The Dixie fire continues to gobble forest and homes with it, growing 20,000 acres in a day, now the eighth largest fire in state history. In recurring afternoon winds, it jumps lines and highways. These are the predominant areas that the fire is running a strike team from Marin County Fire took these pictures. 60 department personnel are up north. Crews heading for downtime went back into action, struggling to save homes as the fire blew up the past 24 hours. Highway 36 got blocked by fire, and so resources uh, could... You know, I was listening to a broadcast on Colfax, and they were saving homes that... <sighs> First, they said the homes were very large, massive, and dotted in the hills. That's not where you're supposed to be. If you understand Agenda 21, Agenda 2030, they're burning people out of these rural areas. They do want everybody in very tight um, mega-regions. They're reshaping the country. And this is so friggin' heartbreaking to see community of Greenville just burn up. To read comments, ran from Colfax. These homes are literally being brought down, you know, just, they're 
everything in the homes. These fires, I look at them and they're so surreal. This happens in a matter of hours. These fires are so hot that they literally gut everything, but not in its path. It seems very selective. This is the river fire. <clears throat> and it looks like two homes are on fire. <sighs> then you have this line of fire. It just doesn't, it doesn't look like a natural fire. Not to me. I'm not, I've never been in this industry of fire, so what do I know? But oh, please, if you're in these areas and you can help, <clears throat> You know, people who are running away from these fires, lend a hand because they need help. But look at this. You know, the they show massive fire. They show, you know, then you come across this plastic boat. Clean, no ash, nothing. It's and right behind it, these bicycles were hit, trees are fine. Where, how, how does that happen? All right. River fire on Twitter. This is turning into yet another instance of a dangerous California wildfire outrunning public communication regarding necessary actions had to run from a fire. How often have we heard that? One hour time lapse. This thing, this thing just really did explode. Here are the fires. Here's one in Nevada, California. I think this is the Dixie fire. Or this, I don't know, Dixie Fire, River Complex, Antelope Fire, McFarland Fire, Monument Fire, and River Fire. And here it is, Call Flag, uh, the fire near, or, yeah. A whole lot of homes burned in Colfax. What did they say? 20,000 acres in an hour? Beautiful, incredibly beautiful area. Oh boy. And is this the cloud creation from the fire? I don't know because I've seen these uh, I don't I always think of nanotechnology. I can't not because it is operating all of these little flecks of cloud. That's not natural. Colfax. Boy, Ugh, my stomach is just, it's, it's so gut wrenching to see this. So, I 
Rita, I really hope that you check in with us. Let us know how you're doing. And anyone else. I mean, I don't... I'm so sorry for people who have to live like this.